So standing beside me is Yuri, who is the product manager for Loaders and Bobcat. Yuri, first of all, thank you for agreeing to have a chat with us today. We were talking off camera and you were saying that you've been working with Bobcat for 18 years. I'm with the Bobcat 18 years. Yeah, so I, how did you start with Bobcat? I, I already started as a manufacturing engineer. Yes. Uh, and then I moved with the projects here and then I led into the manufacturing engineering, building the new factory here. Then for a couple of years, I moved to US. I uh, have been part of the development Over team. in North Dakota? Yeah, developing the MCs, the 400s, yes. 500s. I was in that core team. And then I moved to the product management. So I'm in charge of the skid steer track loaders and compact wheel loaders. Yeah. We have the new series yes, exactly. of Bobcat loaders, which is the your series. Yeah. And these machines are made in the United States. Correct. Yeah. yeah, a lot of people is asking what is the purpose of those machines mm -hmm. and we are trying to satisfy the customers of every edge. So yeah. starting from the smallest K-series style of S100, S70, then going to M-series, they are still the compact with the, this transversal design yeah. to be as most compact as possible. And then we bring the RCs and the RCs is probably the state of the art, yeah. uh, one piece cabin, uh, it's having the different architecture inside. But doesn't matter, the product important, yeah. it's about comfort, it's around yeah. the customers. You say Bobcat, you know exactly what we're talking about. 60 years, over a million machines, it's, yeah. it's, it's great to see them, that a full lineup. But of course, you said, we're here today to talk about the newest, the biggest, yes. the baddest, <laughs> which is the S86 and of course the T86. Now this is my first time seeing them, so... What was your impression? Tell me. It's, it's really, really big. Uh, the S76 is big and of course the S850 was big. It, it just seems bigger in every sense of the word from the tires to the arms. It, it seems like a beast. Yeah, exactly. These models, they are replacing the, our 700s and the 800s of the MCs. So this is going to be replacing the both, the yes. skids. Uh, and over there, the track model is going to replace the T870. Mm -hmm. And this one, it's all outperform even 870 model. Wow. The first time, 105 horsepower on that machine. Very big beast. You can see the significant difference in this area. And mm -hmm. you think, oh, why so many hoses here? And that's why we are introducing the super flow. I heard that, yes. And, and that's something what customers are looking mm. for. When you say super flow, what type of output are we talking about? We are talking roughly about 160 liters mm -hmm. into the 28, let's say, megapascal field. So is that going to require a new range of attachments that are dedicated superflow attachments as well? Exactly. Yeah. You can use the high flow attachments mm -hmm. as well, but superflow attachments, you're going to have the new range of the superflow attachment yeah. that they can work with this output. And then yeah. definitely the customers will appreciate the performance coming soon. Yeah. Because when people saw the Aura Series Lotus first versus the M Series, it was obviously a wholesale change. Everything starts from the customers. You know, we are looking, let's say, for but behind our customers and trying mm -hmm. to understand what are their needs. Mm -hmm. And they were looking for, let's say, we would like to be more spacious cabin because we are staying in the machine for a very long time. Mm -hmm. And this is what we did for them. So inside of that one piece sealed cabin, yeah. you, you are very, very quiet environment. It is, yeah. What kind of weight is this machine? So the weight of the machine is uh, roughly about 5.6 ton. Mm -hmm. What is very impressive, the tipping load of this machine with the bucket mm -hmm. is over 5 ton. So which means that with the pallet, actually you can lift almost 3.5 ton of weight. Wow. Which is impressive. Yeah. You said the machine is very big, but yes. for this lift capacity, the machine is very compact. Yes. Just trying to imagine different equipment that will lift almost this weight. Yeah. Yeah. And this is the first one that's been here? Yeah, this is the first one. So we have here first two pre-production machines that we want to show our customers mm -hmm. here. What is really great here, so you can see the undercarriage. So if you remember, we introduced the five-link torsion Forces. undercarriage. Yep. This is very unique because this one is providing the stability of the solid undercarriage with the comfort of the roller suspension mm. previews, even outperform the roller suspension. What is unique here, you can see the triple flange roller on yes. the back. Yes, yes, yes. And this one is helping the detracking some of the customers have been facing yeah. in very rough applications. Yeah. So this one, and it also improved the comfort of the ride because the, the track is rolled, let's say, or it's tracked by the three flanges. I've been asking this question to everyone in these videos your favorite Bobcat machine. And I think it'd be one of the track loaders, it could be one of the skaters. If you had to pick one. If I should pick one, it's definitely the track loader. Yeah. I love this big one, yeah. but for the compactness, I'm probably choosing the smaller one. Okay. Because I was part of the T450 development. So yeah. I, I love this machine, T450. Yeah. It's the smallest compact track loader on the market, very performing. So that's my favorite. That's, that's, your, yeah. that's your baby. Yeah, that's my baby. Yeah, yeah okay, very good. <laughs> well, look, come here, thank you for taking us around these machines for showcasing it all. 
And um, yeah, look, that's been great. Thanks, Yuri. Thank you. Yeah, cheers. Hello everyone, William from Adair Machinery here. And today we have gone on the road to County Galway, where we're going to test out the all new range of Bobcat agricultural telehandlers here on Keaveney's Farm. <laughs> 